Welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be checking out the world's most dangerous jobs, man. Be sure to leave a like on this video, subscribe to my channel if you're new, and I'm trying to hit a thousand subs and leave a comment about which job you think is the most dangerous. So with all that being said, let's jump right into it. These are the most dangerous jobs in the world. Imagine risking life and limb for a paycheck. Everyone's seen the deadliest catch. Commercial a commercial fisherman. crab fisherman is an occupation that needs no introduction. Huge freak waves that completely oh. engulf the deck, a ton of swinging metal crab traps hanging from a crane, and the cold of the Arctic. These guys are in their big paydays. When you're tasked with cutting down a tree that's a whole person wide, you're gonna need more than just an axe. Planning the safe felling of a huge tree is a tricky job for a lumberjack. I used to watch the show that everyone was doing it. For cover. There are soldiers, and then there are the special forces. They're so tough that they only get to oh. hang around their other hardcore buddies. Training includes breaking stuff, breaking others, and breaking mm. yourself. Just imagine a squad of these guys behind enemy lines. Bomb diffusers have to be just about the coolest cats around, able to think through life-threatening situations that quite literally blow up in their face. This job is not for the faint of heart. Oh my goodness. Even remotely afraid of Look heights. how high Electrical he is. Alpinist is tasked Easy with pass. climbing up extremely high television broadcast towers to carry out repairs and maintenance. They make a career out of not looking down. Ahead of the annual Mount Everest climbing season, Icefall doctors get to work securing the routes that tourists will take, freeing them from snow and ice and securing ropes and ladders to make the trip. Oh less no, dangerous. look at this, bro. Easy pass. I'm not going down there. I'm not I'm not I'm not going to do it. As if regular firefighters aren't hardcore smoke enough, jumpers. it's up to a smoke jumper to be the first line of defense when a blaze is started in the remote wilderness. Just smoke Drop jumpers, in by bro. parachute and left to fend for themselves, they use chainsaws to cut down trees to provide breaks to halt the approaching inferno. Most scuba divers travel to coral reefs to photograph, but not this guy. He's a commercial diver. What is he jumping what in? What does that entail, you ask? Well, diving into tanks of raw sewage to free oh, the that's blockages. Nasty. Yes, it's a real job, and no, I have no idea how much he's paid to do it. Think of it this way. If we were meant to fly, we would have been like, born with cool. feathers. A thin pretty, piece of material pretty. is all that prevents you plummeting to your doom after jumping out of a plane. It takes a special breed of human to do it for a living. Oil, or as they call it, Texas Oil tea. You're workers. looking at what's perhaps the dirtiest job on earth, covered in muck spewed up from the bowels of the planet at high pressure. <laughs> no thanks. No runway? No problem. You got a stream. You got a place to land. Got a paddock? That'll do. That's hey, cool. Any semi-flat stretch of land devoid of trees is all these insane bush pilots need to set off soaring into the sky oh, and, geez. more importantly, return back down to land safely. A sane person would see an approaching storm. Storm chasers. Y'all boys need to easily stop. Batten down the hatches or get the heck out of there. Not storm chasers, though. They get as close as possible to Mother Nature's wrath. What? Hey, hey, look at bro. Crusty crab, is crab. That boy is SpongeBob delivering the pizza, bro. Look at his wrath. Crash test dummies and ballistics mannequins will only get you so far in the world of body armor sales. The people crave a live demo with a real life person. Yes, that's a real blade right there. And yes, the dummy modeling it is most definitely a company man. Avalanches, tsunamis made of snow that can bury you underneath 30 feet of icy Why you wanna... in a matter of seconds. I it's have scary. no idea if avalanche cameramen do it for love or for the dollar, but either way, it's not a but job we're trying for. Yeah. Technically, linesmen are electricians. They're not wiring up their house though. Anybody getting up that high power lines where one wrong move is nice. have them reduced to a pile of Shout smoldering ashes. No, it's not Captain America from Wish.com. It's just his stunt double. When the action calls for someone to get punched in the face, hit by a car, or thrown off a moving that locomotive, man is fresh. it's a job for Bobby the Stuntman. Ugh. Some window washers are content to use a bottle of water and a squeegee at a set of traffic lights. <laughs> Not these guys. They rappel down the side of skyscrapers to wipe uh, the muck off the 40th story office so your view of the city skyline isn't spoiled. Take a bow, chaps. <laughs> Shout out them. Skyscrapers look pretty, but they have to be built on all these dangerous the jobs are up high. That's the thing. Like, they know people are scared of height. So it takes people working at nosebleed height to rivet and weld them all together. Being the captain of the ship seems like a pretty cool job until you yeah. realize that aye, aye. Shiver me timbers, baby. Happen, you have to go down with it. The sea is a harsh oh, and unforgiving mistress. Oh, throwing 60 foot walls of water at you in an attempt to sink you to your doom. I thought that every hulking tower Look, frame had tall a little elevator inside to take the driver up. If the harrowing climb isn't bad enough, how about being stuck in a little box hundreds of feet above the earth all day? 
Bridge painters spend a year and a half connected to harnesses while tightrope walking thin cables just to get a lick of paint on. Then when they finish, it's time for a second coat. Major Tom to ground control. This astronauts. Is a dangerous job. When you consider they, the astronauts they blow are strapping up. themselves and they to get a giant no air, rocket, which and is they pretty get, much yeah. a glorified can of ultra flammable and explosive fuel, you get the picture. Hitting the afterburners and copying enough G-force to turn your face into a melty pile of flesh cool is too. just another day Top in the gun. life of a jet pilot. Maverick. If you do manage to remain awake while breaking the sound barrier, there's still the enemy aircraft to evade. Yeah, sure, blowing up stuff for a living sounds like a dream job for every firecracker happy kid. The truth of it all is that this is a job where the margin of error between a building imploding versus sending debris flying is razor thin. But demolition is, that's pretty cool. I'm not entirely sure if suspending a helicopter gigantic chainsaw from a helicopter and flying it through dense forest is altogether dangerous. But when you realize that this guy's cutting down tree branches within a few feet of high voltage power lines, it's a different story. Being an F1 driver is no walk in the that park. That is dangerous, that tiny boy. tin can with four Boom. wheels and an it's 800 crashed. horsepower yeah. engine doesn't fare well when hitting a wall at 200 miles per hour. Shark divers are people who've never seen the Jaws films. Whether it's a tiger, a bull, or a great white, a human is just a bite-sized meal for any large shark. Attacks do happen, still it doesn't stop these guys getting into the water with their video cameras. Would you take a bullet for a paycheck? If you're a bodyguard, the answer is absolutely. It's all in the name. Protecting the royal, rich, and famous is a dangerous job, but someone has to do it. Bring your own black suit and set of cool shades. It's a crazy job, but someone has to do it. Let's Fire take a second to appreciate our Respect. brave firemen and women who don't give a rip about their own well-being and willingly run into fiery infernos to pull people out to safety. Are you a fan of being assaulted, spat on, and disguised Physical. by literally Respect. everyone in your workplace? Then a corrections facility officer is the job for you. Diving from the high board into a deep swimming pool is cliff an Olympic divers. sport. Choosing when my parents went to Jamaica, the they saw cliff divers. That looks great. Insanity. Hope this guy enjoys broken ankles because I don't. One bumblebee collecting pollen from a flower. It's a swarm of bees ready to envelop and sting an entomologist disturbing their nest is an entirely different story. A man who wears a hundred thousand bees instead of a tracksuit needs his head examined. Zoos are an awesome place to enjoy Aww. exotic creatures from like, behind the safety oh, of Jesus. toughened glass. Spare a Zoo thought for the keepers, keepers who nearly end up oh, as lunch on a daily too. basis. It takes a special kind of person to venture to remote, Touch unforgiving rescue, places respect. and rescue the other people reckless enough to try and conquer them. Who's more insane, the mountain climber or the guy paid to go pick up the broken pieces? When you live high up in the mountains and there's only one route in and out of town, that makes the bus driver a local hero, especially when he's spent 50 years driving through the Andes on roads that claim a thousand lives a year. Being Easy a bus career in the heart of the Big Apple may seem kind of nice, but this is no leisurely Sunday ride. To make the big money, you have to deliver your packages quick. If that means weaving in and out of moving traffic Ooh. and running red lights, then apparently so be it. That one I know what you're stuff. thinking. This climber must have rocks Pass in his rock head. Climbing. Free solo means no ropes. You fall, you're a goner. I can't imagine this guy having any fingernails left after scaling up 25,000 feet over three agonizing hours. I'm dying. <laughs> Wind turbine technicians are the unsung heroes of the clean energy world. Yeah, Think respect. of them as glorified anybody up high, man. Attached to ropes, working on equipment. All right, man. Let me know which one y'all think is the most dangerous. I think anything with heights is astronomically out of my um, range. Like me, heights don't go together at all. Like mag, the opposite of magnet. But let me know what y'all think is the most dangerous, man. Be sure to leave a like on the video. Subscribe to my channel if you're new. I am trying to hit a thousand subs. But all of me and say, I am Aubrey Love. And until next time.